Hi everyone, welcome back to The Chosen One by Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for your support. Today's word is, God says, stay focused. Keep going for Jesus is yours. The end is beautiful. You walking out. I want you to know that you are walking out of a situation that you were stuck in. And God said you are coming out and, it, and the end of it is going to be beautiful. So I just want to say, continue to stay focused. Sometimes when we in the wilderness and when we feel like we just can't get out, God is our source. God is helping you to get out that trouble. God is helping you to get out that confusion. All we have to do is continue to praise God and serve him. In Deuteronomy 31 and 8, it reads, The Lord himself goes before you and will be with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. I want you to know that God is with you every step of the way. And it's very important that you trust God. You have to trust God in everything you're doing. Whatever you feel, let that go and let God in. You have to trust God. God is not your enemy. God is your helper. God is the one that is guiding you. He's the one that's fixing you. He's the one that is making you over. God is the one that is just helping you in every everything that you in. Whatever you in, God said, I'm helping you. I'm fixing you. I'm getting you situated. You got to trust God and you can't be discouraged. You can't be afraid. You got to fully put your trust in God and let him do what he need to do in your life because I want y'all to understand, we got, we have to go through trials and tribulations. When Jesus was going through his changes, you know, when he was going through changes around him, you know, he told us, you won't have trials and tribulations, you know, but you will overcome. And I will give you, he said, he will give us his peace. So God said he will give us his peace. We have to just trust the Holy Ghost. And know that God is in control of everything. I just want to say continue to stay prayed up. Continue to do what you need to do for your salvation. Don't be afraid. Don't be scared. Just trust in the Lord and do what you got to do. And just say, Lord, you have your way in me. Because at the end of the day, we got to do what's best for our salvation. Do what's best for us. Because the devil is here to steal, kill, and destroy and he don't care who you are. You know, he can use your grandma. He can use anybody against you for no reason. But I want you to know that the end is beautiful. The end is beautiful. And you walking out, you're coming out of that situation. The end is beautiful. I just want to say, keep your head up. Be strong. Stay focused on your relationship with God. Don't let nobody mess up your relationship with what you have with Jesus and just stay focused, you know, stay focused, be consistent and just, just push through everything and know that you will make it because if God is for you, who can be against you? Nobody can't do anything because God is your protector. God is your protector. He's your healer. He's your provider. God is your way maker. God know you more than we know ourselves. So God don't want us to be afraid. He don't want us to be scared. He just want us to learn how to praise him in the midst of the storm. Learn how to praise God in the midst of everything that you're facing. Don't give up, but pray about it. I love you all. Be encouraged and stay blessed.